Look, my waking up repertoire is pretty limited. There's like two songs that I know I could start with. That's it. Hey there, on the Zaukow playing Outer Wilds. Uh, and uh, you know what? Let's hunt down the Shadow Orb. Yeah, I could try and get gobbled up by a jellyfish, but let's change things up a little bit. I want to at least like set my feet on it, and then like it can just be like part of my. Whoops. <sighs> Tempted. You know what? Yeah, it has been in the way. All right, suit up. All right, so video games. Um, yeah. So satellite. I know where it is. So here's my plan to make it work for me. Where is it? It's normally around here. There it is. So last time, what happened is that I stood by the satellite, right? Until basically the 40 degrees mark happened because I wanted to see what happened. And then I saw a ball of void uh, fly right in front of the sun. However, Due to the distance between the sun and the satellite, I did not have time to catch up. So what I am going to do is I'm going to park myself right next to the satellite. I'm going to look at the screen until it says like 30. And uh, at 30, I'm going to orient myself with the sun and I'm going to start going in that direction. Hopefully, this means that uh, we will intercept each other and I'm gonna be able to interact with it maybe a little bit that's the dream Ooh. Ooh. all right yeah we are we got plenty of time like I just kind of zoom right here so I'm staying like this when that counter turns to like I don't know like between 25 and 30 I'm gonna orient myself with the Sun and go so suffice to say if you don't want DLC spoilers because you're waiting for it to be released on a switch or something unfortunately around these times is when you're gonna have to get off this ride until until you're able to catch up sadly I'm sorry but this is what I want to do. I want to meld my DLC and main game experiences together. You know what? I thought I'd be doing like a big cut or something, but we're already almost at 30. And I just so happen to be saying things here and there. All right, where's the sun? I just bump the satellite, it happens. So let's just go. By the time I get there, uh, the thing should be there. Now, I have no idea really what to expect. Is it something I can, like, I can experience, I can interact with? Like, it's a big ball of emptiness. Like, what does that mean, right? How close am I getting? Am I going too fast? What if we did a little bit of that? Like, I still need space for that thing to exist, right? So... My angle should be good. Let's just wait here. And you know what? If it doesn't show up, that's fine. I got plenty of stuff I want to do. Let's see if it shows up. Am I too close? Like, did I get too close to the sun and it, like, went behind me or something? Because I feel like by now, I would have seen it. I think I went too close. I went too early or something. I mean, that's a feeling I have. See, the issue is I don't know for how... Mm, I think I think I missed it. I think I went too early. And I think I went maybe in front of it. Like it went past behind me something. Alright. I mean... Fair enough. Turns out I have stuff I want to do anyways. So, uh, where's Giant Deep? <laughs> That's Bramble. Where is Giant Deep? Is it behind the sun or something? Now that I've noticed that stars were exploding, I can't help but notice how many stars are exploding. Every time I'm just kind of 
flying in space. No, seriously, where's Giant's Deep? I could look at my map, but... Whoops, wrong button. But map is offline. Alright, here we are. The deepest giant. <laughs> or so they say. We got a little friendly moon here, too. I know you. Alright, let's approach this carefully. Well, I mean, I'm plunging in the water. Because my goal is to get down deep. That's the shadows, don't worry. Yeah, oh, well, don't crash on any of the wall. You can help it. Alright, it's just a little crash. It's a fine crash. Alright, so yeah. So you see, like, there's a jellyfish right there. Is it gonna go out of the protective windshell? It's certainly looking like it, right? Uh, although that's like right in the mega storm, and I'm not exactly at the right place for that. Ooh, but you though, you might go exactly where I want you. Just yeah, just close to it, but not quite there. Perfect. So I'm just kind of chill here. I hope I didn't scare it. I hope that my presence excites it and makes it want to come out. I don't know how much it can per 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 perceive the world around it. It seems to be sinking back. That one might be rising. That one would be good. Maybe I'm missing something still. Because, yeah, none of them are going high enough. None of them are escaping the... The pressure. Oh, man, okay. So, Feldspar told me how to get into the electric circle. But I still have a wind barrier to traverse that I don't know about. Ooh, I can be in a wind sandwich though. Yeah, that's right. That's what we're doing now. Man, so... Breadcrumb, I missed my train, and then I misinterpreted my breadcrumb. What, what to do? What to do? I'm not sure. Uh, I mean, there's another island here I've never been into, where it looks like there's a... Like a, a docking station is the best description I can give. That's Gambro's haunt. That's not where I want to be. This place is kind of hard to navigate because, you know, the islands move around. Hey, there's Gabriel's ship. Do you think I can interact with it? It's not even open. Alright, whatever. Okay, I saw a note, so that's this place. Yeah. Fantastic. That's that place. I've been there. There's another place. Paul, well, I don't think it has a name. But I gotta find it. Oh, it's falling on me! It almost fell on me! I think this is the place? Well, that's where I'm going. Oh, there's stairs and everything. Alright. Look at that! Instant delivery. Love it. This is why the Nomai are so great. Okay, I saw these stairs going on down, and here's a tree. Isn't that sound? Here we are. Someplace new. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So, we got the storm shields, and here we got this. Ooh. So, this is where... I'm assuming that's, that's the cannon, right? Yeah, with the three module and everything. This is where they built that. Sweet! I gotta read things. Check it out, I'm gonna press the translate button. So yeah, we finished building the final orbital probe cannon module, which was like the cannon. Sweet. Whoop. Send privet up to everyone to install the probe tracking system, right? That's for tireless work. Fantastic. Uh huh. <laughs> yeah. Don't worry, it will break. <laughs> That's so good. Uh, are you going gelatinous on us, love? Uh, gotta say that to someone one day. 
<laughs> uh, they're fun. They're fun people. So, they built this. This is one of them. There has to be a breakdown of who's who, right? That's a uh, gravity floor. Might be worth going on. Anything else here? storm shields for when there's a storm all right yeah like this is gravitron gravitron there we go and had to gravitron a little bit oh boy like you just know that the second i try to do something silly here is when i'm gonna get kidnapped by the sea there's another one of these Ooh, real hollow projection stone. Okay. Um, just need to find a table for that. There's stuff over there like plans, but I'm on this side for now. We'll go visit soon. I hope. Uh, on this side, there's not really anything. So, we'll go visit soon. Now. I'm not gonna try and jetpack across. If I do that... That is exactly when things are gonna get timed so that I get flung into space. Looks like I don't have much of a choice, so. Okay, so, all right, so we're here. Is there anything below here? Yeah, like, this is where the can was made. Like, this is why this is so big. And it's like big and round. Oh, and there's a floor? No, I'm just on the wall. All right, that's what I wanted. I wanted to be here. Spinning around. Look at that. We got blueprints. Very precise. But considering they can think they're... Yeah, I recognize these. They, like, they can think designs onto surfaces. I suppose it's not too surprising. There's another... thing pad there. Alright, real hollow projection stone. Do I recognize this area? No. I do not know in Brittle Hollow where this is. I have never been there. It's pretty rad. Uh, there's like two tornado machines there. I'm not sure what's up with that. Uh, but these also have text in them. And here's where I can do a little bit of that. All right, this is, oh yeah, because I'm John Deep, and then we've got John and Boop. All right, and we've got water particle reflection looking weird. Uh, for assembly. So, okay, okay, what's this about? Uh-huh. How did that happen? Tell me in details how that happened. <laughs> okay. How, how did you do it? Model of Giants D in Brittle Sound and reveals how an object might sink below the current. How? 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 God. Okay. Well, I gotta visit. <sighs> okay. Okay. So visit the the observatory has the answer on how to break through the current. Fair enough. Ooh, is that how much time is spent already? That wouldn't make sense. Ah, <sighs> jeez. Okay, well, that's another reason to visit Brill Hollow, at the very least. Can I just not put you on the floor? Because there's another one right here. Control module. Control it up. Get teleported. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So, I know this place. I've been here. The storm going on in a real life, I think, is influencing this a little bit. I mean, things are, like, kind of framey today. Well, like, here, at the very least. I don't know what's up with that. Alright, what do you have to say? Uh, Yarrow? Yarrow? Okay. There we go. My, the water drop was in the way. The problem with the proposed power source, the overflow program won't be asked to fire. <laughs> don't pull my locomotive limb here! Certainly can fix the problem when it comes on infinite hiatus. I mean, they fixed that. So, 
errors with the powering system, but this is something they fixed at some point. Like, it did not remain a problem. Um, okay. Is there anything else to be gleaned from this place? I want to experience a tubing. So I'm gonna wait here until the island gets picked up by a tornado. Cause yeah, like it's hitting right for the mega storm, but we're actually gonna hit that one. Look at that, everything is purple cause I'm in the tube. Beautiful, I love it. You can see the beautiful engorged red sun on the verge of collapse. Always a good time. You can tell we're back in orbit because my globe map came back. Wow, so we lo we, we get high enough that even that gets good bob now. That's amazing. Alright, so observatory. Observatory has my answer on Riddle Hollow on how to carve through the wind. Turns out the answer that I got was an answer to a problem I didn't know I had. And you know what? Fair enough? Gabo? Did our things collide or what? What are you doing here? Why is my... Yeah, okay, it's identified. Um... Is this supposed to be happening, dude? Uh, <laughs> um, okay. Well, we're having this conversation in rock now. What is going on? Like, this is clearly... Something happened, right? And I cannot speak to you anymore. No, I can. Uh, I found your ship. <laughs> yep, it is. Uh, it. Well, it's hard for me to tell, actually. Uh, all right, I found other things. Yeah, I did. Uh, yeah. Over enthusiasm. <laughs> The only thing of a Nomai that can break is if it applies a Nomai amount of force. Uh, that is true. Well, I mean, it's because it, it never gets stays broken down. Hey, this is true. <laughs> Whoa. Uh-huh. That's true. I mean, I know where it's gonna be, so like that's not an issue. Anyways, um, your island and another island have merged. And I don't think that's supposed to have happened. You seem to be taking it well, so who am I to judge? Like, how did this happen? What happened that this happened? Is there anything else? I did all of that. Like, there's not the, hey, you said everything. Ooh! Wait, what? Um... <laughs>